Hi, my name is Pastor Jerry Ingalls from First Baptist Church in Newcastle, Indiana, and we are on a journey together of studying the Bible one chapter at a time, and I'm writing a short devotional thought on each chapter and sharing that with you. Today we're going to look at Hebrews chapter 11, and according to Hebrews chapter 11 verse 1, faith is the assurance of things hoped for, the conviction of things not seen. Verse 6 further explains that without faith, it is impossible to please him, for he who comes to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of those who seek him. Amen. Now the Apostle Paul in Romans chapter 14 verse 23 unapologetically teaches us God's perspective about faith that quote, whatever is not from faith is sin, end quote. Wow. Now unfortunately for most of us, knowing this is not enough to convince us <laughs> to live by faith alone. Okay? We each need daily encouragement to do the right thing for the right reasons at the right time. That is why the Bible is full of stories of people who are real people with real faith and real history dealing with real circumstances, all right? To encourage us. These are living testimonies. In fact, Hebrews 11 is called the Hall of Faith, the Heroes of the Faith. And here are three snapshots of some heroes that we can learn from. First, Noah trusted God and against all evidence and public opinion built an ark to save humanity from God's judgment. It's in verse 7. Abraham trusted God and left behind all that he knew to set out on the journey to claim God's promised land. It's verses 8 to 10. And then Sarah trusted God and after 90 years of not being able to have a child, she conceived a son who would inherit the promises of God. It's verses 11 to 12. So I encourage you to open up your Bible to Hebrews chapter 11 and then cross-reference these stories to the Old Testament starting in the book of Genesis and read these great stories of faith these testimonies in Hebrews chapter 11 are real stories about real people with real faith and real history. So important for you to understand. These stories of these real people and these real historical happenings are intended to encourage you, to motivate you, to edify you, to live according to your faith no matter the circumstances of your life. Seize the moment and let your story become a real life illustration of faith to all those around you. Seize the moment.